Hello. Good morning. Well, yeah, time zones are magic, aren't they? There might be morning somewhere in the world. Man, it, it's weird. Like, somewhere across the globe, the world might have ended already. And we just don't know it yet. Fuck me, the game is very loud. Has it been that loud before? Ooh, here we go. Let's see what main menu girl has to say to us today. I haven't seen you for a while. It's good to have you back. Ah, uh, no one greets me like that when I come home. Do we just continue? God, I love her eyes. Like, oh, jeez. Stop. Stop. Stop, Lambda. Stop. Stop. Just stop. Stop thinking about it. Okay. Good. Everything is working, right? I don't know why they didn't put a soundtrack like underneath the, the the loading screen or anything. Or just some sound effects of this circle going woo woo. I don't know. You know, it's kind of like a weird choice to just go, all right, uh, it's my artistic choice to just leave this loading screen silent. Mr. Cage, are you sure about that? Yes. Oh, we're back with Kara and um, what's her face? Alice. Alice, she's trusted. Well, she's trusting me, I guess. Slowly. Don't wake her up. Real silent, Kara. Real silent. Okay, here we go. You did it. Still sleeping. It's kind of a challenge to get up while a child is next to you, you know. Check. What, I'm gonna, am I gonna lick her to see if she's still alive or something? Like, that's what Connor would do, I'm pretty sure. What the fuck? Don't just... You're gonna wake her up like that? That's not how you check on a kid. You, like, hold your hand in front of their mouth to see if they're still breathing, maybe. Or you watch if their, like, um, chest is moving up or down or something. It's the dude. What's his name? Ralph? Ralph? Ralph the serial killer? Anything to say about that, Kara? <laughs> oh yeah, I9, I've heard about that. We didn't really talk to him yesterday. Oh my god, what's that? It's a dead fucking bird! Ooh, money. Let's take a look at the watch first. If it's broken, it's gonna be the time of murder, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, okay, uh, that's like, uh, did anyone, like, uh, seven, seven o'clock, like, uh, almost eight o'clock or something. Let's touch a dead bird. Or is it a figurine or something? I can't tell. Is it supposed to be real? <laughs> is it, or is it, like, just a weird model? Hi, right, let's take the money. He wouldn't, would he mind? Oh, God, my karma. Now I'm gonna put back. I'm not stealing. Fuck that shit. Kara's not about that. I'm gonna leave. It's his, after all. He killed his owner. He deserves that money, you know? I... Oh, ma wait a second. I killed my owner, too. I should get some money as well. That would only be fair. But we all know life isn't fair, you know? Life truly is unfair. Let's read something. Detroit Today. Cyber World Life. We've read about that one, I think. Canada? Still an Android free zone? Wow. The Leafs did something right, I guess. Um, Canada, where the air is clean and the welcome is always warm, but still freezing cold, I guess. Discover the landscape, discover the world, discover. Oh, Canada. Da, da, da. Da, da, da. Is that that song I'm thinking of? Despite the United States voting in its Android Act as early as 2028, the Canadian Parliament has yet again pushed back its decision on whether to permit Androids in the country. As a result, Androids are still not sold in Canada and have no official status in the country. What if you bring your Android with you on holiday or something? With Androids continuing to fuel unprecedented growth in the US economy, yet contributing to record levels of unemployment, the arguments 
for and against putting them on sale in Canada rages on. But for the time being, Canada remains an Android-free zone. What about the rest of the world? Like, this this game was clearly made by people that are very, uh, what's it called? Anglo-centric? Is that, is that the term or is that like, uh, I don't know actually. Like, people that think that the world revolves around America, basically. Revive fire. Oh, okay, sorry. Who? What you gonna do? Change appearance. Find new clothes. Oh, of course. Also, scratch, scratch out your ring or something. Canada is based in this timeline. Yeah, but only in this one, Blue. We all know about Canada. We all know. It's not gonna work. You need to put some new wood on there. Yeah, yeah. Find some wood. Um... Can I just chuck the child in there, maybe? Is that like an insensitive joke? They can't even misspell words. I am alive. Well, it's like um, a youth speak, you know, where you just abbreviate words. So you just left out the apostrophe and like it's an I, the M stands for AM and then alive. Am I allowed to go up there now to, to find wood or? Ooh. I want to play. Out of this world. I guess I need some, some coins. Can I go out to get wood? No. Shit. Did I? Ooh. Oh, there's wood right there. Okay. Take. Why didn't I take this wood yesterday, I wonder? <laughs> the rest of the world of America is like the pants and the hat. That's right. <laughs> Wait till Alice wakes. Oh, great. Fuck me. Like, is that on a timer or can I just like accidentally knock against the table to wake her up? Oops, sorry, Alice. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, no. Now I can go up. Okay, pretty good. Let's see if the body is still there. Did she actually sleep? Do androids need sleep? Well, I guess they have like a standby mode or something to conserve energy. So the body is still here. It's still looking... C can we actually take a glimpse at it? Oh, come on. It feels a little bit voyeuristic and weird to do it like that, but... Oh, God damn it. They're gonna reveal, are they? Or is this just... Is this like a hidden easter egg that you can find the body up here? Oh, what's in here? Oh, no, new clothes, I guess. Of course, of course. Damn, that's a cool jacket. Oh, for a second I, sh I thought she was going to start to undress. I got excited over nothing. Oh... <laughs> Yeah, looking good. You know, it's it's very like um, very hip if uh, if women wear men's clothes, right? Oh, that that skirt looks. I I don't even think it's a skirt. I, I just think I don't even know. I think the sweater might be too long. So I guess a woman must have lived here then. Oh yeah, judging judging by this, a woman definitely lived here. Uh, take the gun back, by the way. All right, that's good. Like I had my chance to leave it here, but now I'm gonna pick it back up again, <laughs> just in case we could ever need it in the future to shoot some more tots. I don't know. What am I supposed to be seeing? It's raining still. Very comfy. How do androids recharge? Well, you need to give the mana, you see. And the way you give the mana is by... Uh, ah, not allowed to say that on Twitch, I guess. No, wait, that was the Fate franchise. Sorry. I got confused. That's how you give magic power to... To... 
I don't even know. What are they called again? Like, w wizards? Witches? What are they called? Like, masters. But what are they, actually? No, wait, servants. That's the way to give mana to servants. Oh, but you can also transfer mana be between masters, I'm pretty sure. Like, Yeah, yeah, I, f I seem to remember. Uh, you get mana from land cards. Yes, that's another way. What are we, what are we doing now? Cut hair. Oh, I guess in the bathroom. Why would I cut my beautiful hair? My ponytail is just long enough to act as a little handle, you know? And it's cute. Oh god, look at the way she... she okay, we're gonna have to do this again. Look at the way she goes up the stairs. Like, isn't that the cutest thing? The, the way she's holding her hands, like... Boop, beep, boop. Beep, beep, boop. Very feminine. I very much like it. Okay, cut your hair. Don't accidentally stab yourself or something. I don't know how precise androids are. Or how precise I'm gonna be with my controller. It doesn't work like that, by the way. You can't just cut a strand of hair and think it's gonna, like, look good. Eh, I'm not a fan of the pixie cut. Can we change it back again? Like, can we... Ooh. Ooh white hair! Eh, nah. Blonde? Is that what we had, basically? Black. That could look good. Mm, oh yeah, actually it looks the best. Wait, who does she remind me of? With this haircut and the black hair. One of the Resident Evil girls, I'm pretty sure. Finish. I'd like to finish on that. Oh yeah, remove it. Oh, oh no, no, that's gonna hurt. Do it with your fingernails, maybe. Not with the scissors! Oh, the sound it makes. Oh, that's just disgusting. Thank God I didn't damage myself. Take the scissors with you. You never know when you could need them. I do not like short hair. Yeah, yeah, it's like... Mm. I mean... Oh, I have the option to open the curtain now. <laughs> like, women with short hair. Like, there are some that can really rock the look. But it's like men with long hair, you know? You, you need to be a good-looking person in the first place to really... You know, to really... Um, get the look going. Like, there's some very good-looking men with, with longer hair. but And there's also some very good-looking women with shorter hair. But you could argue that maybe they would look better if the man had shorter hair and the women had longer hair. It's all just a matter of taste, I guess. In the end, it's a matter of taste. In my opinion, there's only a handful, handful of women that can, like, even um, look good with um, a fully shaved head. But that woman needs to look very, very good. Oh my god, Spoopy. Huh? Hmm. Oh my god, did he get cut with the scissors I just used for my hair? What is that? Oh, like these players. How does that work? Isn't that a major design flaw? Yeah, um, I like long hair. I like playing with it. <laughs> it's very cute, Blue, actually, that you admit that. Just put on a hat. Yeah. Oh my god, is that Connor? <gasps> That's all for now. It's Connor and Hank. We need to run. Wake up, Ellis. <clears throat> We've got officers sweeping the neighborhood in case anybody saw anything. Okay, well let me know if they turn anything up. Why don't I have any umbrellas? What are you gonna do with that? <laughs> he just stands there. <laughs> I love Connor so much. First bus that came along and stayed at the end of the line. Its decision wasn't planned. How does he know that? Androids don't feel fear. How does he know that's what happens? They get overwhelmed by their emotions and make irrational decisions. Alright, well that still doesn't tell us where it went. It 
didn't have a plan, and it had nowhere to go. Maybe it didn't go far. That's a smart take. I like the voice actors of Hank and Connor as well, I think. They're doing a very... Oh, shit. Ralph found this to feed the little girl. Nice. <laughs> it's good for her. Yeah. A present. It's gonna make her grow up strong. Make up for past misunderstandings. <laughs> Ralph will cook. We will do just like humans do. Humans but like we're not... Meat. We're not humans. Come. Come and sit down. Yeah. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with Ralph. Sit. Sit down, Alice! That's better. <laughs> Sorry, that was a little bit loud. <laughs> Ralph went to a lot of trouble to find something for the little girl to eat. Look, he's even setting the table for us. That's nice. He'd like for her to refuse. Yes. Would it? I agree, actually. <laughs> I want the tail. Please. Not the head. You don't just chuck it in the fire, by the way. Succulent, you'll see. Succulent? Succulent. <laughs> that word! <laughs> Succulent. Mm, I have a new favorite word now. Please, Carl. I don't want to eat that. What did she say? She said she loves to eat it. She said she can't wait to eat it. <laughs> She's very hungry. <laughs> this little human is not going to regret it. <laughs> Ralph found the best, the biggest one he could find. <laughs> this is going to be succulent. Ah, oh, the word again. Yes! <laughs> Eat. Let me eat first. I'm hungry. <laughs> Did you see the ring flash red on his... Um, I still don't know what it's called. Eat. The side of his head. Uh, uh, ask about corpse. Bluff. What about that corpse? Upstairs. You killed that human, didn't you? Oh yeah, in, in front of the kid. Smart. No, he was like that when Ralph found him. Hmm. Family? You said you wanted to be like a family. Ralph? Father? Mother? The little girl, remember? Father would never threaten his little girl with a knife to make her eat. Is my frame rate dying, by the way? It looks very choppy for me. Ralph went to a lot of trouble. That's why. He just wanted the little girl to eat. But Ralph is not bad. No. Not bad. Looks fine. Okay, thank you. Then let us go. Hi, by the way. Anybody uh, home? Hi, Minimoto and whoever else. There's blue blood on the fence. Why would he announce himself? Oh, wow. We're just taking over now. All right. We're going to bust Kara. We're going to get her. Come on, Connor. Run, you fool. We know how to get in here. There's a door in front. Hello? Oh, we can actually look in. Hello? Android inside the house. Oh, is Ralph gonna be a, a, a like a distraction, a scapegoat for us? I very much like Ralph's coat, by the way, like his uh, cape, rather. I wish we could still wear capes in these times, and it wouldn't look like as malady as it would. Scan the android. How do I, how do I scan him? I'm just gonna ignore him. I'm gonna go upstairs. I'm pretty sure they're up there. Good boy. <laughs> oh, I can't actually just ignore him. Is anyone upstairs? No. Nobody. Ooh. Well, okay. Is that a function only I have? Like being able to tell if they lie or not? Uh, if Deviants? Wait, what's X again on my controller here? Are there any other androids here? Other androids. Oh yes. No. Wait, 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 wait. Ralph is alone. Does he like it if I go back here? I'm looking for an AX400. Use the door, Connor, while we talk. Use the door. Ralph you can do two things at once. Connor. 
Well, <laughs> that's a lot of RA9. They're hiding in the oven. There's blue blood on the fence. I know another android was here. Ralph scratched himself coming through. Wait, as soon as I... That's Ralph's blood. No, no, I don't want to scan him. I, I would love to scan the table to see that he set the table for three people. Signs of software instability. Moderate probability of self-destruction. Bust inside Kara? I wish. Burn mark. Irreversible skin damage. Extreme heat. Oh, you don't see. <laughs> Uh, he's a gardener. Oh, okay. Can you not just replace his broken eye like Marcus did, by the way? Take a look at the table. Oh, here we go. Hmm, table set for three people. Food? Androids don't eat. All they do if they're going crazy, I guess. Don't be afraid. Oh, he's very unstressed now. Okay, I think, like, going up would have been the way still. Can I not? Connor just stops. Did I miss my chance? The camera perspective. Oh, here we go. I can change it. I forgot. Still very weird. Can I talk to you? No? Was there something else I'm, I was supposed to see? Like, I can investigate this. Alright. Good. <gasps> A security notice. Find source of stress. There's a fire. Androids don't need fire. They don't freeze. Androids don't need heat. We have to rem remember that. Uh, there's... Oh, wait a second. Androids don't read. Perfect tool to cut a wire fence. Oh, okay. Can I go up now? Still can't go up. Okay, I really don't like that the game is basically forcing my hand. Damn, his stress level is really going up as soon as I step near the, the, st the stairs. Do we wait until it's at like 100 and he just explodes in his pants? No? I don't know! Coming, Help me! Help me! I, there's nothing I can do! Do I just leave? That's not right! I know they're here! Game, that's kind of fake, you know? Let's just go out. Uh, maybe I can investigate out. Well, he's, he's saying I'm coming, but there's no way for me to go outside either. Can I talk to you again? It doesn't show my goal if I do this. Oh no, find source of stress. I. I. I'm. I. I thought I did. Did I screw up by going up under the stairs? <gasps> Let me sleep. You're such a smart little cookie. Run quick, Kara! Oh, Ralph, my friend. Ouch! <laughs> oh no, wait. We don't feel Connor, what's going on? pain. Here. Call it in. Which way did it go? That way. They're headed for the train station. Why didn't you run after it, you f moron? <laughs> run. Run, 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 run. Wow. Riveting gameplay. I just have to hold my stick up, you know? And he runs all the way. All on his own as well. It's gonna be a quick time event soon, I assume. Over there. Why did you run after them? They're carrying a fucking child! You police officer! Just move! <laughs> God damn it, why do I have to do everything? And now you're coming! Oh man, they're gonna have a muddy butt later. Oh, please don't tell me I have to do this. <laughs> I'm very bad at Frogger. I agree. Oh god, fucking, can you kill her? I might have to check actually. I 
Oh no, I can't. I can't do. Oh my fucking lord. I can't do. I can't let the little kid die. Come on, I'm a father. I can't let them get away. They won't. And never make it to the other side. Are you serious? you will get yourself killed. Do not go after him, Connor. That's an order. Uh, okay, I'll give up. Hank like that. I want Hank to love me. He's my friend. Up. Oh shit, I screwed. Oh fuck. Did that hurt actually? Oh, they don't feel pain. Oof. Jeez. Uh, X. Up, 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 up. Uh, what about me? Hey. Hey, 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 hey. Alright, we made it. That was successful. Mission complete. Should have made him go. <laughs> Gotta test games. I'm. Uh, you know the way I play this game, right? If I make a mistake, I have to live with it, basically. I lost Connor very early. And I didn't go back. Come on, we're getting all wet here. You really shouldn't kneel in in a puddle like that. Why does no one in this game have umbrellas, by the way? You didn't lose him, he's still there. We lost Connor 1.0, though. Oh, look at the points. Oh, look. Oh, Jesus Christ. That's a lot of choices. Kara and Alice reach the other side. Why is there, like... Oh, God. Is Wait a second. What? What is that? Oh, if you're not in the squad, I guess. You can also be in the motel and you can be in the car, I assume? Damn, this game. Oh, this is this is actually impressive. Is this the best Daniel Cage game? I mean, Heavy Rain was alright, but it wasn't, like, great, you know? can also see the twist coming a mile away. Um, Jason? <laughs> uh, sorry, every time I think of Heavy, heavy Rain. Uh, Indigo Prophecy, like Fahrenheit. <laughs> it was a fucking dog shit game, but I still loved it. And I haven't played... What is the other one? Beyond Two Souls? I haven't played that. Is there another David Cage game, actually? Several sources report that Cyberlife has provided Detroit police with a prototype detective android. Although police assistant androids have existed for several years now, oh, I'm Marcus. Can they tell? I did bitch quite a bit, you're right, Desperator. I was a little bit peeved about the fact that I screwed up that early. <laughs> But I stuck with my, uh, you know, with my decision. Ooh! Wait, do androids have a memory or something? What, where did I get that from? Every rain is good? Eh. I mean, it, it is good for the first playthrough. But uh, you reach a certain point and think. You spare some change? Uh, I don't know. Do I have anything? I don't have anything. I'm sorry. Um, like after you reach a certain point, and not to spoil anything with heavy rain, just in case you haven't played it, uh, play it if you get it uh, on sale or something. But it is like a certain point in the story where it all basically falls apart. Not as bad as Indigo Prophecy, but Indigo Pro Prophecy, um, aka Fahrenheit. That's a symbol. I found it. It's here. Do androids have a memory? <laughs> Did you ever play the game called the Library of Arena? I mean, like, can he just... Uh, w wouldn't they have something like a perfect memory? Wouldn't he be able to... Uh, how do you put it? Yeah, I guess what we just saw. Like, watch it back like a movie or something. I don't know. It all depends on... I don't get it. By the way, I don't get it. What I'm doing here? Hold to the side for the graffiti? Oh, hold RT. Um, I lost my point, actually. I What was I talking about? <laughs> this game. <laughs> Find this graffiti. Oh, man. Can we just move along? Marcus is a little bit boring. I don't know where they're going. Also, is that not the symbol for the androids on my coat? 
better service. I don't know. Who? Who's creepy? Can we just stand in the way of people actually? Oh, apparently not. Oh wait, oh, I have to make a decision. Oh, it's Android only, I was about to say. Blend in with the humans. Let's see if we can stand in the way of someone. Someone is bound to come back up here, right? No, I can't even get closer than that, so. Why's my controller vibrating? Ah, oh, it feels good. Connor is the good part of this game. The others are just, dude, society. Well, I do wonder if we will ever reach um, this point, basically. In the w oh my god, look at the reflections in the water. It's actually impressive. Like, graphically, uh, like the lighting is a little bit simple. But the details in this game are pretty good. Oh, we can talk to her. Do you know where Jericho is? Great. Doesn't even answer. Thank you. That's very rude. Can I talk to you? Uh, boxer man. Boop. Oh, there it is. Boop. Clue updated. Oh, that's a wild goose chase, isn't it? Isn't isn't it the house over there? It is the house over there. Just run across the street. I can't. Oh, we we we're not allowed to walk. Don't walk. Behave like a human, Marcus. Do I need to press something to make it work? Humans would walk regardless. Possibly right about that. It depends on the street, I guess. I really don't understand why people don't have the patience to wait like 20 seconds at a traffic light. I, I absolutely fucking hate whenever someone does that. Especially when there's kids around. Oh, here we go. I triggered it. Okay, the other one is up here. Let's live dangerously. Hmm. You're a bad example for anyone watching you, though. I'm looking for a robot. Am I just free to explore this? No, apparently not. Can I? Can't cross the street like that either. Cars don't stop anyway, I'll take my chances running. Wow. Oh, Manimoto, you're from Italy, right? I've heard, allegedly, that like Italians are um, very wild when it comes to uh, driving cars. Like the, the Southern European countries in general. I guess. Like you can hear the same about Spain and Greece. I think. Germans love the cars, so they're mostly very careful with them. You don't want the dent in there. You don't, you know you don't want to run over a pedestrian and leave a scratch or something. Cuz that's going to cost some good money. Germans love the money too. What am I looking for again? A little robot. A robot person. Because since we're an android, we, we're gonna call it an ro a robot person. Oh, wait, we can cross the street over there. R quick, 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 quick. Since just calling it a robot would be insensitive. We all envy <laughs> my f <laughs> our 300 kilometers per hour highways. Well, oh my god, where is it actually? Am I blind?
It's overrated in my opinion. Do I maybe have to go in there or something? Can I enter? Where the robots at? Danger. Authorized personnel out. Or I guess unauthorized personnel out. So it's gotta be here! For heaven's sake. I walked past it like three times or something. Come on, I can see the sign. Let me scan it. Can I get in there somehow? Oh, I can crouch. Uh, don't worry, we're in Detroit. Everyone does that. Uh, I live close to a big road, probably a highway. I think everyone does that in Germany. <laughs> like, what well, is that kind of... It's not a very specific um, location. Uh, here we go. You know what I don't like? Have you ever been to the Netherlands? Like they have uh, lanes for bikes for 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 cyclists, and these guys they just they they think they own the place. God, I I I love the Netherlands. Like it's a beautiful country, but that really bothers me. <laughs> I really hate anyone on a bike. Because they can still kill you if they run you over, you know? Where are the other symbols? Find a way to reach the roof. Is there a ladder somewhere? Oh, can I climb? That looks like I could climb. Come on, that looks climbable. Like, I could do that in real life, I think. Get on there, get on there, and then do a big jump and haul yourself up. Why is it called the Netherlands if it's not actually land? What? Bikes were a nightmare, so I guess you understand what I'm like trying to say here. Oh, there's something I can scan. Oh, I can move this. Oh, pff, yeah, okay. All right, let's make some noise here instead of going the parkour way. Oh. Wow, dude, you could have had that way easier, you know. Uh, where's the third one? Oh, there it is. Really not liking this right now, by the way. It's, it feels very boring. It feels like at least two graffiti is too much at this point. <laughs> oh, yeah, well, you're gonna jump? Do we kill him? Pre construct. Use the right stick to select the route. Uh, huh? Use RT to preview route. Ouch! Would be too unstable. Rewind with left trigger. Try another one. Uh, I. Oh, okay. There's, there's another one here. Okay. I guess I had to see the failing one. Uh, let me guess. I need to like hold on to this thing. Yeah, here we go. Epic, let's compute. Execute. Nice, I, I just have to press one button, he does it for me. It's like playing video games in 2021.
Sparkle City Repair Store. Boop. Boop. Uh, where's the third one? Possibly somewhere. Somewhere where you can see it easily. Anyone find it yet? Where is it? Oh, I got it. It's yellow. And hidden when you scan. Oh, God damn it, Marcus. Just... Just... I don't know. Fuck Jericho. It's very boring right now. Okay, it would not be solid enough. Like, unlike my shits. Do I have to go all the way back? Uh, now what? Oh, that, that's gonna be a failure because, yeah, the game likes to throw you the easy ones that are not gonna work, though. So... I have to run along the wall, obviously. Makes a lot of sense. It's gonna be a, like another decision point here, I guess. Alright, this one or this one? This one. Now, ah! Uh, this one then. Yes, that makes a lot more sense as well. I agree. I agree, Marcus. You, you do you. Epic, and then look back like a gangster. Some cinematic quick cuts, you know, to make this look even more impressive. Yeah, yeah, look back just like I told you to. That's right. Oh, again, the game, like, graphically, it shines. Actually, that's a lot of good... Are you okay? Hello? Can I LB you? Can I... Maybe I need some spare parts for later. You never know when you get dumpstered again, you know. What am I looking for? Uh, it looks like this. Oh, I need to line it up correctly for me in order to scan the, the QR code, basically. Uh, some planks of wood, I think, over here. I should have just let Marcus die, I think. Where am I looking at? Oh, oh, it's the name of a ship. Oh, that, that could have been easier to solve. Maybe just a quick Google search could have helped you, you know? Oh, what's the name of the big ass fucking tanker? Currently being stranded in Detroit. Alexa, the name of the ship you're looking for is Jericho. Thank you, Alexa. Oh. Well, I guess no one enters that ship anymore. I I don't understand. Like, just just drop down somewhere then. Boat. Wait, what's the difference between a boat and a ship? A boat is bigger. Is that is that it? Oh, I don't know. Why is there a massive fucking tank stranded in the middle of Detroit? Magic. Magic and magnets. It's the same. There wasn't an optional kill off Marcus? I could have just left him in a dump. Could I have not failed the quick time event with like the android that strangled me in, in the junkyard, maybe? Oh, it's so hard to do. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> this 
Bodhi McBoatface. Yes. Would have not been religious enough though. Bodhi McBoatface. The Lens Flayer. Okay, drop down. You can't be serious. <laughs> I guess. Oh, a leap of faith! The symbolism is strong in this one! Imagine if it was a solid surface instead of water. That would have been the end. Someone stole the ship. <laughs> What is that? Flashlight? Ah, oh, the wrong kind. It only... Yeah, okay. It would be a nice genre shift if, they, if there's suddenly zombies in there and I find a weapon and I have to shoot them down. And this turned into some kind of like survival shooter. Jammed. Locked. Can't go that way. What's my goal currently? Explore the boat. Okay. Okay. I assume this one is gonna be locked as well. that look look at what push oh oh look at that it's Kara Android on the run runaway machine causes panic in Camden with miles of unspoiled nature Canada is the true land of the free president Warren to make state visit to United Kingdom do we read about, like... <sighs> now, residents in the D Detroit suburb of Camden were witness to a thrilling chase today after a police manhunt, including roadblocks and dozens of police interviews, flushed out a felony fugitive. But this is a fugitive with a difference. The suspect is an android. The rogue AX400 model is thought to be suffering from an extremely rare malfunction and took ex extreme measures to avoid police even dashing across a busy highway to avoid pursuing officers. Uh, eyewitness statements are inconclusive and with no official report, it's impossible to say for sure what really happened, but local news correspondents are looking into the case at this very mo moment. No CyberLife spokesperson was available for comment, and the speculation looks set to continue. Android astronauts to explore IO? Which one is that? Can anyone tell me? Like, what, what am I looking at? Is that Jupiter in the background? Wait a second, wouldn't that take years and years and years of travel? NASA sends Android crew into space. Hackers target solar panels for latest ransom scare. <laughs> Hello, ma'am. I think your, your solar panels are damaged. Um, Android astronauts to explore Io. NASA announced the launch of a five Android crew to explore Io, one of Jupiter's satellites. Oh, okay. The journey will last three, three years. That's it's kind of short, isn't it? A moon of Jupiter. Damn, the UK still exists. They always will, I think. Um, journey will last three years and it is expected to teach us much about the formation of our solar system. Why? Well, what would going there bring us really about the formation of our solar system uh, aren't we like able to perceive and like um look at a lot of stuff considering how f like telescopes are crazy telescopes and satellites uh, the concept it boggles my mind but a lot of things do since i'm not the smartest guy around though not the first androids in space this is the first all machine crew proving that androids are sufficiently reliable to be entrusted with the entire mission yeah, why don't they just replace humans altogether? Androids are an extraordinary asset for the conquest of space, said Michael Shalley, director of NASA. Cosmic radiation destroys human DNA. 
Does it? Humans suffer many effects from long-term space travel, while androids are immune to most of these issues. Uh, what, really? Is it really that bad to be in space for uh, extended periods of time? Do the people in the International Space Station know that? Is that what it's called? ISS? Yeah, I think. Uh, NASA confirmed no return journey was planned and that the androids would work on Io for several months before being destroyed by the extreme conditions of the planet. That's very... Very good. Very good. Dude, we went to Jupiter. Why? I don't know, man. The humans told us to. <laughs> okay, let's die. I was looking at the chat right now. I didn't even see what that was. But I don't think the game does a genre shift, does it? What, what was that? What was that? Like, there's a dead end over here. Something must have lurked here. Waiting for... Oh, I'm gonna scare this guy real good. Let's run past and scream like a little girl. Huh. Oh, that was dangerous. You could have died, Marcus, if I didn't press X quickly, you know? Oh, I have to go in here. Hello? Can I not? Hello? Marcus? Don't be a dummy now. Go in! What is... Oh, oh, no, 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 no. I can't check this corridor out because game says so, but I can open this apparently. All right, okay, okay. Oh, no, no, no. Now, now I can go in. No? Oh, yes? No? Hello? I'm moving. You can see that, right? It's, it's, I'm not, I'm not an, I am an, <laughs> fucking hell, Marcus, what the fuck? <laughs> what was that? What, what, what happened? What's happening? Are you destroying the whole boat by yourself? Ouch. Going through a door is hard, okay? I struggle severely every day. Doors are scary. Oh, where the fuck did they come from? Sorry, I just destroyed your boat. Wait, he looks like... Welcome to Jericho. Doesn't he look like a uh, Ralph guy? Welcome to Jericho. Guess I missed some stuff. I 89% complete this. It was very... Um, uh, what's it called? Linear. Okay, what, what would this have been? I could have done something else here. Read on the run. Read Android Astro. Or maybe depending on what I do earlier, there would have been another article in the news thingy. Alright, let's just continue. I'm glad it's not Marcus anymore. Hopefully it's not Marcus anymore. Yes, it's Connor. Nice. <gasps> Careful. Reconcile with Lieutenant. Why? Why? What happened? Oh, I'm getting hungry. I had I had some gnocchi for dinner today, but I've been told to leave some over for like Babby to eat tomorrow for like uh, lunch. So I wasn't able to eat like quite enough I wanted. It's a hundred percent guaranteed. You can't go wrong. What's going on here? Let's scan this guy. Are you a deviant? Mister. He is Abda Pedro. Unemployed. Criminal record. Illegal gambling and fraud. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Can I scan him for weapons or something? <laughs> I didn't have right, Nokia. I had Noki. G N O C C I. Many Moto can tell you all about that, I assume. What is your problem? Don't you ever do as you're told? Look, you don't have to follow me around like a poodle. But you like dogs. <laughs> uh, apologize for behavior, partners. Uh, partners. Now that we're partners, I thought it would be a good idea. Don't nudge him like that. So we, can work as a team. we are not partners. I am a human. You are a machine. So just spare me that buddy of bullshit program, okay? Okay, that didn't work. Um, I guess. Here you go. Oh, let me guess what's gonna happen. I'm gonna scan this shit, I'm gonna see the calories, and I'm gonna warn him that that's not, like, good for his pump or something. Fucking, I... I David Cage, you fucking hack! <laughs> you fucking... Jesus Christ! <laughs> oh. What is that? Hamburger. Oh, it looks lovely, though. I want that now. Time for burger. Is there spit on it? Oh, that makes it better. Oh. Uh, thanks, Gary. I'm starving. Don't leave that thing here. Huh, not a chance. Follows me everywhere. Uh, wait, let's read that. You just can't resist. Our food is prepared by a human. Does that make a difference? Our chickens were born with two legs and two wings only. Wait, there are different chickens in the future? Oh, it's cute. Look, look at that. It's wearing shoes. Our sauces are homemade. What are you waiting for? Oh, I don't want to wait. I want a burger now. Missing cat. A 17-month-old cat escaped from his home May 10th near Detroit Way. Oh, God, it looks ugly. New, try our delicious French fries. Oh, I'm so hungry. With our organic homemade sauce. Why is it a winking face? Why is the organic homemade sauce? Why does it require a winking face? I demand to know. Wait, left button. Okay. Okay. Uh, baseball. See? Three, three dollars for some chicken nuggets. Six dollars for drumstick. Um, seven dollars for some like regular like chicken, I guess. Twenty dollar, twenty dollar for a whole chicken. Twenty. Like everything else seems reasonable, but twenty bucks for for a whole chicken is very expensive. Sponsored by Doritos, by the way. I oh, know it's Iggy's. It's not Doritos. It looks very much like the Doritos, though. Don't, don't, don't talk. Don't uh, enjoy your meal. <laughs> Free meal? I don't, I don't really like when the game forces me to, to answer in a timely manner. Gary's a friend. I scratch his back, he scratches mine. Oh, okay. I understand. <laughs> What's your problem with androids? Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? No. Why do you hate androids so much? I have my reasons. Okay. I understand that. Can we... Talk about me? Is there anything you'd like to know about me? Hell no. Well, yeah. Um, why do they make you look so goofy and give you that weird voice? Thank you. Cyberlife androids are designed to work harmoniously with humans. Both my appearance and voice were specifically designed to facilitate my integration. Well, they fucked up. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, shit. I, oh, there's some snot out of my mouth. Or rather, no, it's, I need to... <laughs> Oh. No, fuck and me. I don't like filling out paperwork for damaged equipment. Deviants. Maybe oh. I should tell you what we know about deviants. You read my mind. Proceed. We believe that a mutation occurs in the software of some androids, which can lead to them emulating a human emotion. In English, please. It is English. They don't really feel emotions. 
they just get overwhelmed by irrational instructions, which can lead to unpredictable behavior. Which is basically emotions, isn't it? Emotions always screw everything up. The androids aren't as different from us as we thought. Wow. You ever dealt with deviants before? <laughs> Getting a flashback to the first time I died. A deviant was threatening to jump off the roof with the little girl. I managed to save her. So I guess you've done all your homework, right? Know everything there is to know about me. Um. Nah, let's tell the truth. I know you graduated top of your class. You made a name for yourself in several cases and became the youngest lieutenant in Detroit. I also know you've received several disciplinary warnings in recent years, and you spend a lot of time in bars. The music in the background is so annoying. So what's your conclusion? <laughs> uh, let's be sincere. I think working with an officer with personal issues is an added challenge, but adapting to human unpredictability is one of my features. Did he just wink at him? Oh no, uh, we're going crazy. <laughs> oh, okay, we got an email. It's a few blocks away. We should go have a look. I'll let you finish your meal. I'll be in the car if you need me. <laughs> just stiffly walks back to the car. Come on, finish your burger. Hey, Connor. Run out of batteries or what? What? I'm sorry. Uh, what happened? I was making a report to Cyberlife. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> Awkward Android well, flirting. Staying in the elevator? No. We can only hope I'm so, Kane. I would be up for some flirting between the two. That would be lovely. <laughs> Question the suspect. Uh, what do we know about this guy? Not much. Just that a neighbor reported that he heard strange noises coming from this floor. Oh, great. Nobody's supposed to be living here, but. The neighbor said he saw a man hiding an LED under his cap. Oh, Christ. If we have to investigate every time somebody hears a strange noise, we're going to need more cops. Fetus. Columba Livia. Oh. I accidentally... Are you really making a report back there in the elevator? No, nah, I was spazzing out. closing your eyes? Correct. Shit. Wish I could do that. Bye, let me sleep. Bye. I want to see this again. Like, what was the feather type? The bird? Oh, I wish you could, like, rescan stuff. Because the controls in this game are kind of weird. Knock, knock. Who's there? It's me, Connor. I don't make jokes. Anybody home? Open up, Detroit police! Stay behind me. Got it. <laughs> yes, Daddy. It's very hard to do that, by the way. Opening a door by kicking it once. But he did the right thing by kicking uh, near the lock. That's how you're supposed to do it. But don't just run against the door either. Like like in the movies, you won't be able to open it with brute force of your shoulders or something. You're gonna hurt yourself. Ooh, like that. Don't do that. Like, that doesn't work. That doesn't work. Uh, it's a lot of birds. Uh, oh my god, that's a lot of fucking birds. That's so many fucking birds. Looks like we came for nothing. Just birds. Look at the amount of birds. Who's feeding them? Where are they flying off to? Oh, okay. Come on, birds, be free. You don't need to be in here. God, they're coming back. Wait, what, what am I hearing here? More RA9. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. Any idea what it means? RA9. Some deviant bullshit. Written 2,471 times. Impressive. It's the same sign Ortiz's android wrote on the shower wall. Why are they obsessed with this sign? 
Looks like mazes or something. What? What? Mazes? What could RA9 stand for? We all know what A stands for. It's analyze. So maybe it's rapid analyzing. Nine. Wooden stool recently disturbed. Traces of avian fecal matter. Hmm. Lick it. Lick it, Connor. A marker. Still wet. Used recently. Color midnight mood. Black. It's opened. Someone was here writing on the wall. Was here recently. I agree. Must have been. Can I go back in time now? Ooh! Suspect ran to the living room. I went left. How does that work? Why does it go forward? Oh, because it's a reconstruction. Okay, he, he fell like a dummy. Went to the living room. Do I? Can I? Okay. Oof. <laughs> Lick it, Connor. Lick it. You know you want to. Mmm. Bird shit. Oh no, it's blue blood. With a little bit of bird shit mixed in. Ooh, bird shit. Take. Oh. They're learning, I guess. Like, if a lot of them remove their, like, little it's LEDs. In the sink. Not surprised it was an android. No human could live with all these fucking pigeons. No, maybe a crazy pigeon person, you know. Ah, Jesus, I hate these things. Oh, no, they're actually, like, I like pigeons. I mean, not that much, you know. Not as much as, like, this dude did, most likely. Finger marks recent. Oh, scratch marks. Skid mark, recent. Traces of galvanized steel. Wasn't that like galvanized? Wasn't that a song by... What's what's the name? Metal hook, recently broken. Who who had that song called Galvanize? F Fatboy Slim or something? What was that? Fatboy Slim? Do you, do you guys know who I'm talking? Is, is Fatboy Slim even still alive? He ran towards the entrance. He heard us enter. He is still here. Exposed him. Hank, I'll have you know that he's in the attic. You know, Connor really needs a heat vision. They must... They must... They must radiate heat. Hey, 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 hey. X, 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 X. Hey, 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 hey. Run, 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 run. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, the music is good. Right trigger scan. Easy but slow, fast but risky. Who... How do I decide? Fast! Hey, 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 hey. What, what was risky about that? Balance, safer detour, fast but risky. Balance, 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 balance. Oh, the music is very good. Direct but crowded, safer. Di direct, 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 direct X, 12. Left. Hey, 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 hey. That was easy. Come on, game. Throw me a freaking challenge every once in a while. Hey, 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 hey. Where did he go? Up there. Okay. Ooh, run through. Just run through. Okay. Uh, outside. 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 This way. This way. This way. Uh, how do I? Direct but slow. Fast but fast but risky. That's it. That's my name. Hey! Whoa, oh! 
Oh, I screwed up. It didn't go Y before. Oh, the music is great. Don't jinx it. <laughs> yeah, holy shit indeed. What is going on? Hey! Hey, good job. Whoa, 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 Run, run. Oh, that's some impressive, like, uh, locations they chose for this chase. Hey. Hey. Uh, direct but crowded, yes. Look out! Right. Oh, I think that was the wrong choice. Left. Damn. Very athletic, though. Hey, 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 hey. Damn. You use your scan vision! How did Hank get here? Oh my god, Hank! 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 Save Hank! Save Hank! Don't even think about it! Fucking what? Shit. Oh shit! We had it! Fuck! It's my fault! I should have been faster! You'd have caught it if it wasn't. He's my friend now! That's alright. Of course I'm gonna like prioritize you. You're human. I don't know, I didn't get a look at its face, really. Hey, Connor. Is he gonna say thank you? Nothing. Oh, okay. It's alright. Oh, <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> My name's Connor. My name's Connor. Let's take a look. Could Hank have died? Holy shit, Hank maybe could have died. Or maybe, like... Don't save Hank, he still survives, but you get the android, but Hank doesn't like it as much. Gaining on Rupert. It's Rupert, by the way. Who the fuck is- why do I know his name? Do, should I know this guy? Have we found a Rupert before? Oh, well, could I have fucked up? Like, don't gain on Rupert? Oh, okay. The, the middle one would be, uh, like, Rupert is, like, at a safe distance. So he definitely gets away. I only get the choice to save Hank when I'm when I'm gaining on him. And the uh, the bottom one would have been like uh, we lose sight of Rupert, but wouldn't that also imply that he got away? Weird. Only sixty seven percent of people chose to save Hank. What is wrong with people? Ah, oh, not Marcus. Ah. <laughs> Who are you? Fugitives. Just like you. My name is Josh. I'm Simon. North. That that's not a name, that's a uh what's it called? <laughs> Android? How many are you? North is not a name. Still in working order. The rest were damaged escaping their masters. Many tried to reach Jericho. If you succeed, humans have little pity for our kind. Okay, who established this place? Because it's very dangerous to get here in the first place, you know? Then you knew that only an android could follow the trail, didn't you? Only those who are like us can find Jericho. If you could decide the signs, it's because one of us trusted you enough to give you the key. Well, I mean... I wouldn't... I wouldn't call it trust, I would call it like uh, desperation. <laughs> I don't understand. I thought Jericho was a place where androids lived in freedom. We do live in freedom. It may not be what you hoped for, but here we have no master. We don't belong to anybody. I understand how you feel, but we have more freedom here than you ever did. I was pretty all right, I think. Somber. Maybe I was never really free. Wow. Maybe I was only what my master wanted me to be. No. Now, I need to decide who I No, am come on. Carl was a nice guy. He was a little bit weird, but nice. Just like the rest of us. We didn't ask for this. All we <laughs> we didn't ask for this. Deal with. <laughs> he literally just said it. Oh. You're safe here. Great. You can stay with us as long as you want. Okay. Right, so what are we doing here? Is there like Don't any entertainment? 
might be able to help you. Lucy? Who is Lucy now? Are you like coming on to me? Saddle in, find Lucy, explore Jericho. Not if I can help it. Are you Lucy? Please? I want to find Lucy. ASAP. Oh, this doesn't look like weird at all. What's the point of cables that have been cut through? Can anyone tell me? Oh, 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 look at the top of her head! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> she doesn't have a top of her head. <laughs> Where's my freedom? Can I not say? No, I'm not gonna sit down. You're not my mom. Maybe she is, actually. Show me. Uh, okay. And sips. Wound, of course. I guess. I think we hurt ourselves. Okay. Oh, yeah. I'll stop the bleeding. Whoa, 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 Drink this. It's Kool Aid. But in blue. Black current Kool Aid. No. No, actually. It smells funny. Okay, I'm gonna drink it. Mmm. Consumed a chalice. <laughs> uh. Give me your hand. No. Where's my freedom? What's she gonna do? Like, read my palms or something? Get out of my head, woman! Get out of my head, Charles! You had it all, and you lost it all. You've seen hell, and now hell lives in you. Your heart is troubled. A part of shadow and a part of light. Which will prevail? Your choices will shape our destiny. <laughs> she looks so weird. It's a typical, like, fortune teller bullshit. Just tell me vague things anyone can, like, um, relate to themselves. Oh, you're a very sensible person. You're creative. You like to do things that you love. Um, someone near you is very dear to you. And you might find your luck someday, you know? <laughs> what do I do now? Like, was that Lucy? It was Lucy, okay. Oh yeah, I'm gonna start a fire. They're gonna like that. Look at my impressive fire starting skills. I am a fire starter. A Marcus fire starter. Beep, 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 beep. So that's what you guys do all day? You just stand around looking at nothing? I sh never should have come to Jericho. Wait, at least she's playing with a ball. Wait, can we get an... She's not wearing a skirt. Okay. We're safe. You. What was your function before coming here? What do you care? Resentful? Oh, well, fucking suck my dick then, you stupid bitch. No, no, just don't ask anything. I don't like her already. What do you care? Oh, just uh, fucking be an edgy mysterious cunt. How long have you been here? No, don't ask anything without my input. Four weeks, three days, eleven hours. Marcus! When I escaped, there was nowhere else to You don't need pussy. You're an android. Jericho seemed as good a place as any. 
Talk to someone else. I have to ask something. Fucking guys need spare parts and Why hasn't anybody gone to get that? It's not that simple. Can't just go shopping at a cyber life store. Anyway, nobody wants to risk leaving Jericho. If you came here for comfort, you came to the wrong place. So we all shut in needs? Cool. I actually kind of like that. Leave. I don't want to talk to you anymore. You're, you're dumb. You're a dummy. You're a little dummy. Okay, you know that? Why am I starting all these fires? Like, what's it What's it for us? Like, we don't need light. I have a flashlight. We don't need warmth. We are androids. Is he gonna turn... Like, put it out again? I'm a... I'm a fireman android. We can't have that. It's a safety hazard. No? Apparently he likes it. It's kind of weird when you try to act human. Can I talk to you, my friend? Hey. Hey. You like that? You like that? Huh? You like you like this? Yeah. How does it feel? <laughs> Sorry. Can I talk to you? Huh? Damn, he looks he looks creepy. That guy looks creepy as hell. Maybe we can make him look even more creepy. Is there like a photo mode in this game? We can put the flashlight below his face, you know, and take a take a picture, like that. No, okay. Oh look, there's RA nine on the wall. Hmm. It's a letdown if you can't just be silent. Yeah. The game punishes you by picking just any random bullshit instead of going, all right, you have the freedom to do nothing. Oh, well, so I'm starting all these fires for them to gather around or something? That's... Why? How? You, you, you don't look too, too good. Death? Nothing. No. No, I don't. You're androids. You don't have a soul. Nothing no, happens. I'm about to find out. Great. Make sure to send me an What's email. Marcus. Don't touch me. Why do they even talk in the first place if they... Wait, did she just die while touching me? I didn't do it, I swear! It wasn't me. It wasn't me. Ooh. Slowly, carefully. We have a nice new statue now. Can I just knock her over? Like, accidentally bump into her and go, Oh, 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 sorry, 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 I didn't want to do that. Sorry, everyone. <laughs> Can I talk to you? Like you're sitting on there? No? And you're sitting there too, I guess. Okay. I have a commentary to make until about the game, but I'll wait until the end. The end of the game or the, the end of today's stream? I guess the end of the game, right? Don't want to spoil anything. Do you feel sorry for androids yet? Nah, no, not really, no. They're still machines in my opinion, in this case. Like, they don't have a soul, really. Do they? I mean, I wouldn't just discard them, because there's value in all things. But they're not living things, you know. Also, the fact that I'm supposed to sympathize with the likes of Marcus when Marcus is just the most boring mother trucker on Earth is a little bit bad. Don't tell me I have to talk to her again. Yeah. Pretty sure I started all the fires, didn't I? Like they're blocking this the, the stair oh my god, what's happening here? Wait, does kid androids? Oh yeah, didn't we read about that before? Somewhere. About kid androids. Why would you ever want that though? They threw him out when they didn't want him anymore. And now what? 
He was living on the streets before we brought him here. Okay. They'll all shut down if we don't find a way to help them. To help them, we need blue blood and bio components. We salvage what we can from those who shut down. Don't tell me the kid is sad. But there's never enough. It's an android. So how do they survive? They won't. We're slowly dying out. It's because you don't reproduce. <laughs> You're androids. <laughs> you could fuck like rabbits and nothing would happen. Come on, check on the kid. Are you okay? Just come on, just get up. Don't don't be a dramatical little like crybaby. Just get up. Drink some of that blue Kool-Aid and like you're you're way better afterwards, believe me. Why did they give it to me if there's like so many of them suffering and hurting? Give it to the child first! No, you know why? Because androids don't have hearts. That's why they didn't give it to the child or the dying person! The one that literally died moments after I got healed by weirdy Mac Lucy face. No, no, let's just let her die. She was a lost case anyway. What do I do? Can I... Like, he looks like I should be able to talk to him because he talked to me in the cutscene. Let's see if there's something I can... Oh, here we go. Please tell me that's my way out. There's a ladder there. Crate already emptied. Oh, it's spare parts. Well, if we need spare parts, just go to the, like, junkyard. Cyberlife Warehouse and Docks, West Torrance Avenue, Detroit, Michigan. Uh, did chimpanzees have s do do sh wait, wait, wait. do do chimps have souls? Yes. Did the Neanderthals peop have souls? Yes. What is that kind of question? <laughs> you do realize that they were human, right, Desperator? And animals have souls, in my opinion. Yes, yes. Oh, look at that! We can talk to him now. Simon. Wake up. I know where we can find spare parts. Cyberlife warehouses in Detroit Harbor. They have everything we need. The docks are guarded. We can't just walk in there and take what we want. Humans will never let us. Which is why we won't ask permission. We don't have any weapons. And even if we did, none of us knows how to fight. We can steal what we need without fighting. We'll just get ourselves killed. Maybe. But it's better than waiting here to be shut down. I'm with you. Oh, shut up, Nolf. No one cares about you. Maybe it's worth a try. What's his name, anyway? This guy. <laughs> okay. Did he tell us his name? I'm in. It didn't go bling bling that he liked me more. The question is essentially, when evolution did soul start? As soon as life started, Desperato. Life... For me, life means soul. Life means soul, you know? Marcus hatched a plan. Oh, I missed something in here. Oh, no. I missed something in Jericho. No, what am I going to do now? Back to... Oh, can we not just do some Connor stuff before I end the stream, please? Oh god, yeah, that looks like a murder house. How did we get you? What is this? What is that? Why, why am I going towards a murder house? This is the place. What place? Hello? Did I miss something with her? Like, we just ran across a highway. Does every cell in my body have individual souls? No, because the cells in my body make up a living human being that is me, and I have the soul. You guys are nitpicking now. You're trying to find a flaw in my logic. Which is not logic, it's my opinion. That's why you can't find flaws. I'm always gonna have an answer for you. Zlatko? Who's asking? I was told you could help us. Are you Slatko the no, butcher? I told you that. You came to the wrong place. I'm sorry. Wait. 
We really need your help. Just shove the child in there. He's gonna open up, believe me. Weird killers always want little children. Come in. Don't be shy. We do realize that there's a lot of discussions that could actually be um, reduced down to being pointless or stupid. Lightning hand. There's a lot of things we can't understand or explain or anything. But just because we don't understand it doesn't mean we can't talk about it. Like, what is that fucking... That, that is some retarded mindset, I can tell you right now. There are a lot of things we don't understand in life. There are things that are just that way because they are that way. And maybe that is the essence of soul, that we can't understand it, that we can't explain it, but it's still there. We can feel it. We can feel that another person has a soul. We can feel that it has to do with life, in my opinion. We can feel that this thing has no soul. It's just weird. You know? This painting? That looks a little bit like... No soul. No soul in this painting. Frost table. <laughs> Luther, would you be so kind as to take these ladies' coats? Oh, don't be afraid of our big friend here. Luther is just another android that I helped. Big black android. He keeps me company in this big empty old house. Why does he not say anything? Like, that's a little bit Please. weird and creepy. Make yourselves at home. Who are you in the first place? Like, what's going on? Why do I feel like we're about to get pillaged in a second? How did you hear about Look it? Look at that painting! <laughs> An android. Oh, Look at that! He said you could help us. I see. It's like this guy's either like the Deviant, huh? <laughs> what about her? She's human. And Oh god. Find a safe place. What is he gonna ask us to do? Somewhere you can start a new Button life. up, Kara. I hear Canada is very lovely at this time of year. Beautiful landscapes, open spaces, clean air, and no android laws. Great place for a fresh start. Yes, that's that's exactly what we want. Of course. I can help you. Uh, can but you first, now? We have to get rid of your tracker. My tracker? what? Yeah. All androids are fitted with a tracking device to locate them at all times. I'll remove yours, and then you'll both be safe. Come on. Follow me. Let me guess. It's located in a vagina, and you'll have to use a very delicate uh, tool. No one can wait for us in the living room. No, she always stays with me. Of course. Okay, what like what I was about to say is that this guy is either like the biggest false flag bad guy I've ever seen in a video game because everything in here screams killer, serial killer, murder house, butcher for spare parts. Or they're going, they're, they're going all out by making it scream that way only for, for the reveal to be, yes, he actually is that way, which... To, like a double bluff or something. I don't know. You know, some games do that. Some games go, oh my god, this guy is so over the top evil. He can't possibly be a villain. Why are the cobweb. Like, <laughs> what's going on here? Like, cobwebs are not a decoration you should use, like, literally like that. We <laughs> have skulls, especially. <laughs> oh my god, what. What if this is not? What if this guy is not Slatko, but he just moved in here? What if Slatko is dead? He does look like a Slatko, though. Oh 
Oh god damn it. Uh, I'm, I'm mentally I'm preparing for a lot of quick time events where I'm gonna have to save Kara. I don't know. I I could just be over analyzing things too. Bad guy, let alone how he behaved. Yeah, like the the body here as well. Like, uh, why did we not like Kara? What is going on? I know you want to feel sexy and stuff, but bottom up, just one more button, uh, button up rather than bottom up, <laughs> button up, okay? And maybe, just maybe, don't don't run around like some kind of like weird ass hipster. Push your shirt in your trousers. Believe me, it will accentuate your bum bum, and it will make you look. Less like a bum bum in the first place. Okay. B b basement. Of course it's in the basement. Of course it's in a murder basement. Wait, is there anything in the mirror we can see that we can't see in real life? No. Did I? Did I miss anything? Can I talk to... What's, what's Big Black Man's face? Name? Big Black Man? What's the name? What was his name? He's huge. Like, honestly, fuck huge. Like, how many meters is that? Three and a half? Your skulls? That's kind of weird. It's a weird thing to have, right? Uh, you, now you have to ask, are they... I, like this place. I agree. And that man. Are they android skulls? Or? I, have a bad feeling. I agree, let's go. Let's go. Um, uh, uh, careful. I know. Great. I don't trust him either. Wow. But we're still gonna follow him into his murder basement. Sorry, Alice. Sorry. It's just the way I roll, you know? Put you into danger. I need a danger. Oh, yeah. He's not gonna... Please excuse the mess. <laughs> I need it somewhere discreet. <laughs> excuse the mess? What am I... Am I gonna run into, like, a lot of body parts and blue blood? No. No, she'll be all right. Where's Ralph? I miss Ralph. He was a predictable kind of crazy. What is she looking at? Dead androids. I bet. I bet there's dead androids there. Come on, Alice. Whoa, 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 whoa. We unlocked something. Okay. Mm. This way, please. What do they use androids of that size for? Heavy lifting? Most likely, I guess, maybe. But don't can they just make the arms stronger? Or is there like some kind of body proportions they need to um, keep in mind? If you could just <clears throat> stand over there. Vodka. Reassuring, really. Oh god, where did he come from? No, don't look at her like... Alice, would you mind moving away from the big black man? Sorry, not to be racist or anything, but we just don't know you. Okay, enter. <laughs> Let's continue to the death chamber. <laughs> Let's just go, Alice. What's the worst that could happen? Oh, yeah, okay, we could die. All right. <laughs> I should warn you. This could be quite unpleasant. Eh... Uh... Ooh! It's the Matrix all over again. Uh, why is he looking at her like that? You know what's strange? Oh no! It's a big reveal. For some unknown reason, the trackers seem to stop working in Deviants. That's why it's so hard to find them. Oh, wait. So. We didn't have to come here. Actually, there's no reason to remove your tracker. What? But you said that... Yeah, but... Run, Alice, run! People believe what they want. You deviants are so naive. They all come to me expecting me to help them. And I just... I can't scan or anything. Them. Can I do anything? Them on. Or I keep them for my little experiments. Uh, you what? No! No, I, I don't want to be reset. Let me go. Ah! Oh, I forgot about the child. Um, lock it up. I'll deal with it later. Uh... Alice, no! Wow. A deviant that wants to be a mother. 
That's that's so sweet. And so deluded. I think it's time we put you out of your misery. Ah, uh, my controller. Help me. Oh, reset. Repairing memory wipe. Um just cancel. Just just press a board. Reset. That's what you get for having a dream. It always ends up the same way. Tears and dissolution. Believe me. You're better off being erased and feeling nothing. No more pain. Help me, black man! Please! Hopes You're an android too! Uh, wait, is he? Uh, he is, right? Almost down to you. Come on! Ah! If there's a time to go deviant, it's now! <laughs> oh, poor little Alice. Oh, looks like mommy doesn't remember you at all, huh? Looks like mommy's Where's the man? forgotten you. Oh, there he is. <laughs> what happened to you? Oh. All right, that's Memory corruption. Ah. We're only 16% in. How could I have forgotten her already? You bit me. Oh my god, she did? You hit her? I'm gonna teach you some manners, you little bitch. That's not what you say to little children. Ah, wake up, girl. I'm pressing every button available. Help me. Help me. Help me. Help me. Meet me in the living room. What? Uh, uh, free me first. Meet me in the living room. Suck my ass. Well, did it, like maybe she forgot, but I didn't. Cause a short circuit. Uh, yeah, okay. How? 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 Quick! 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 Push! 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 Let's see if that's that's gonna help. D did that help at all? Like, what did I do? Blue cable. X X X X X X X X X X X X X Ah, left button. What the fuck? Is that like failed or was that like a red herring? Green cable. Oh yeah, the green cable is next to the vodka. Right button. Uh, oh, that was that was surprisingly easy. <laughs> Error, malfunction. Leverage self. Huh? Damn! Look at my tatas. Is that what what it looks like for for a female to look down? Ooh. Sorry, I'm getting distracted. They should have known when they put the scene in the game. Down. 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 I did it! <laughs> Scary Russian man who likes vodka hits good mummy androids and little girls. Sounds... Sounds like a good character to me. <laughs> Find Alice. Wait, wait, wait. Do we just... What? What can I see here? Oh, don't tell me I could have seen, like, the dead end... The fuck is wrong with your face? What is wrong with your face? Hello? Oh, suddenly all of the weird androids are waking up. Yeah, they. Uh, you couldn't have told us that before, could you? Come on, guys. I don't think she just healed memory corruption. Maybe that's something she actually this forgot. Maybe. I don't know. I didn't make this game. Whoa. Wait. Is she naked? On the right? Am I allowed to show that? He likes to play with us. Um. Creating monsters. For his amusement. That's okay, right? There's no nipples. Disguised nipples. But, but man nipples are alright. Look what he did to us. Oh. Help me then. Help me. Don't run away. They're friends. They didn't do anything wrong. They got exper- Oh my- Okay, maybe we shouldn't go that way because... Well, they, they look very naked actually now that I think about it. 
but I did unlock him. Oh god, what's wrong with you, my friend? I, I couldn't have seen all of that before, really? Did he just release them or something? Where's my gun, anyway? Did I have a gun earlier? I remember taking my gun with me. Yes, Well, they must know that there's, like... It's not like they're idiots with the whole monster thing. Ten minutes remaining. Oh, great. Um, it's, it's not like they, they're idiots. They should tell that this is not the way they're supposed to be assembled. I guess. Maybe that's what they mean by monster. Where am I going, by the way? Find Alice. Don't get spotted. <laughs> Why, I'm playing a stealth game now? Do I just leave? Alice still inside? <laughs> Apparently not. This seems to be a sneak mission. Oh no. Stealth missions in games that are not made for stealth missions are just pants on head like dumb. I'll try and make sense out of them. I would make um, legs for days. To be honest. Just a big hole in the middle and a lot of legs. Yeah, blue star android. That's right, blue. How do you know she's not in there? Find Alice. Wait a second, who wrote that here? Um, what is wrong with their faces? Like, what did he do to their faces? Did he just rip them off, I guess? Oh, wait, what's in there? Is that like an android dog or something? No. Like that big cage. Approach. What is this? It's an android polar bear. Or ice bears, I like to call them. You know, <laughs> which apparently is not right. Open cage! Are you serious? Yeah, he's not gonna maul me to death, depending on the programming. Is that Slatko's room where the voices came from? Oh, look at her. Oh, she's, she's, she's assembled backwards. <laughs> it's actually kind of funny. Sorry. Sorry, I shouldn't laugh at you. But you know, you can slap your own ass. Very easily. Ba -ba -bum, ba -ba -bum. The bear's probably going to help you. Probably. Psst. 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 You should not be here. Shut up. <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, I don't know. No. Uh, spare. No. No, of course not. Why, why, why would I do that? To corridor. Oh! Um. I guess he didn't see me yet. Did he? Can I talk to him? He must have seen me. Come on, he's not an idiot. It's like to end his suffering. It is... Uh, I mean... I am actually on a timer in this game. That's kind of like weird, isn't it? What about this door? Does this door lead to Slatko again, I guess? To workshop. Maybe I can just take a peek. Yeah, to see what he's doing right now. <coughs> it's 
someone looks straight at the camera and says, We're all in a cage. David's cage. <laughs> that would be... That would be the best name drop I've seen in a game ever. Can I talk to, to Big Guy? For me? Can you help me? Can I talk to you again? No? I guess I chose Spear. Now I'm done. Let's talk to, to Big Guy. I'd argue Lufa is guarding the girl. You see? Oh, he's struggling. He's struggling, I think. No, no, he can still do right. Come on, help me. Help me. We're not gonna enter the door right next to him. There's a fire. Oh, can we set fire to the building? That would put a, another timer on us, I think. <laughs> What, what, what was the point of that? Public opinion, skeptical. What does this even mean? Check. What? Check to see if it's hot? Yeah, still hot. Put it back. What was the point of this? Carrie, you're making me angry with your irrational decisions. Skeptical of androids. Burn the house. Commit arson. There's a lot of doors in this place. <laughs> it's too many rooms. Oh, what oh, there she is. She wasn't right next to Luther. <laughs> okay, that's easy. Car. Car, you remember me? Of course. How could I forget you? I'm back up. I'm so sorry. You were right. We never should have come here. Never should have come here. <laughs> we have to go. Follow me and don't make any noise. Lufa is going to be right outside the door. No? Okay. Luther! Now what? Yes, Lord. I'm finished here. Go fetch the little one. Oh. 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 Go, go in there. Go in there. Go in there. Go in, go in here. Go in here. Go in here. To the big room. Height. Height, 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 Is he gonna jump scare us? That's why androids need a scanning function for heat! Honestly, that's like one of the first things they should have installed into their eyes. And optical processes. I'm coming! Are we safe? Can we hear a door? Yes, okay. 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 Oh, I guess now I can. Now I can set fire to the house. Yes, yes, yes. I don't do small time crime. I don't steal. I don't loot. I, I kill people. And set fire to, to places, you know? Escape in nine seconds. Wait, 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 wait. I think I did a mistake. <gasps> um. I, it's, I think it's time to run. <laughs> yeah, I think it's time to just leg it. 
Whoa! Are you serious? Don't damage the goods! Left! Go through the door! Just... Oh, it's locked. Oh, shit! Light man! No! Well, at least he seems kind of slow. X, 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 X! Hey, 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 hey. Oh yeah, we checked that this door was already open earlier. Like I should have been smart about this. Oh, is he gonna take the axe and just axe as a question? Shut up and run! Fuck's sake! I warned you. Dreams always end in tears. You should have listened to me. Yes! What are you doing? Get out of my way. No. Not this time. I said get out of my way or I'll shoot right through you. Shoot him. How dare you? Shoot him. Oh, there they are. Dare you. What are you doing? Who let you out? Me, you fucking get idiot. Me. Damn, look at the ass on that android. I'm your master. I'm your master. Where's, where's the polar bear? <laughs> Just waiting for it to come out and go roar. Did they just, just smash him to death? At least he didn't need to kill him, you know. It, you didn't do anything, really. To obey him. When I saw the little one risk her life to save you, <laughs> slapped him to like death. Opening my eyes for the first time. Is he good now? I could see. Okay, your friend. I know you have no reason to trust me after what I did, but I know someone who could help you across the border. Well, slut go 2.0. Hmm. You and the little one. It's always nice to have a muscle, you know, in your potsy. You know, have a right. have a fighter in our party. I trust you. Nice. He liked that. I guess. <laughs> Computers breaking programming after seeing a child going whoa. <laughs> That's it. Fucking polar bear in the background. <laughs> oh, the f that's nice. Like, that's a nice little touch. <laughs> yeah, should have appeared earlier, but I did enjoy that in the end. Oh. The monsters ambush Slutko. What would have been the other choice? Like, he he shoots him or he, like, beats him up? Slutko catches up. It could have ended, like, Kara reaches the stairs. It could have ended differently. Could we have lost her? And there's just so much, like, freedom in this game, but I doubt I'm gonna play it again that, like, soon. I mean, escape before being reset. There's a whole branch of that where you apparently can, I guess you can regain your memories or something. Like, this is, like, all the stuff you can unlock about Alice, I assume. Like, let's take a look at how people did here. 99% of people found Alice. The 1% that didn't are better off, I think. Only 47% of people check the RA9 sign. Only 47% of people hit under the table as well. There's a lot of stuff I missed, apparently. There's a lot of stuff I could have done. Whoa, okay, a lot of people apparently released the monsters. That's a very popular choice. Yeah, 98% of people... Why? Why? Why are we? Why, why are humans so like sympathetic towards? What do we call it? Like the monsters? I guess they're suffering. They're in need. It pulls at our heartstrings. I guess that's why everyone just goes, "Oh yeah, there's like they're not gonna like backstab us or anything." I mean, they they look like monsters. They they act like monsters, but I'm very sure they're gonna just turn on the person that created them instead of just going in a frenzy as soon as they're free. Like, why did no one think that? Bathroom Android is loud. Spare. 
Spare kill would have changed nothing, apparently. There's not even a percentage of what people chose. Most people are prone to show pity. Pity, that's what I was looking for. Pity. Good. Good, Dafki. Thank you. Um, hmm. You know you won't be the one being attacked by them. That's why someone needs to... Uh, what's it called? So, um, subverse expectations or something? Is that what it's called? Everyone's just curious about it being the first option to do. Yeah, maybe, maybe. All right, um, we're gonna. The game was. I'm gonna end because oh, I'm tired. I've I've had a hard week so far. Oh, my entire body hurts. I'm gonna talk about that in a second. We're we're gonna. Uh, oh yes, on Saturday we're gonna continue with Connor. That's what I wanted to see. That's what I wanted to see. I wanted more Connor. Yeah, I know. Blue Saturday though. Saturday. Sorry, it's just. We need to end. Uh, YouTube people, look at her. I can't. I can't keep looking at her. Okay, YouTube people. Um, bye, YouTube people. Bye, bye, bye.